the general view that we see cross-dressing from is from the male side, right? Where a man is wearing a woman's clothes. That is always where our mind go first when we talk about cross-dressing. Cross-dressing, does it include a woman wearing a man's clothes? And if yes, what can be qualified as a man's clothes? Here in Nigeria because I know in the olden days before now some cultures and religion prohibits a woman from wearing trousers but now we all wear trousers and it's accepted in society and even accepted in accepted in the religion in our churches so can cross-dressing also include a woman wearing trousers is this view on cross-dressing only have in mind the popular cross-dressers that we have here in Nigeria or is it also talking about just men dressing like women in general? Or is it talking about women also dressing like men? Hi, welcome to Legal Saturday. My name is Stella Chukoma. Now, let's define cross-dressing according to this view. Cross-dressing is the act of wearing clothes made for the opposite sex in public or in private even if you wear it in private and the picture of it or the video of it comes out to the public you have committed an offense the act of wearing a clothes made for the opposite sex in public the definition of cross-dressing aside now let's critically analyze this cross-dressing from the dresses of nigerian or from the dresses that we have here in nigeria you know the general view we used to see this cross-dressing is from the the popular celebrities that are cross-dressing right that's where our mind always go when we hear this cross-dressing view but i want us to deviate from seeing cross-dressing and bob risky together cross-dressing and generally together cross-dressing and, and James Brown together. I want us to analyze, critically analyze cross-dressing from another unpopular opinion or, or popular angle. The, the general view that we see cross-dressing from is from the male side, right? Where a man is wearing a woman's clothes. That is always where our mind go first when we talk about cross-dressing. Cross-dressing, does it include a woman wearing a man's clothes? And if yes, what can be qualified as a man's clothes here in Nigeria? Because I know in the olden days before now, some cultures and religion prohibits a woman from wearing trousers. But now, we all wear trousers and it's accepted in society and even accepted in, accepted in the religion in our churches. So, can cross-dressing also include a woman wearing trousers? Does it include wearing Trousers are specifically made for men, wearing shirts and polos specifically made for men, worn by a woman, like shirts, polos, trousers specifically made for men, and the woman will come and wear it. Does cross dressing also include that? <laughs> what is your comment? What is your opinion? Please leave your opinion in the comment section below. It's a good thing that they gave an exception to this rule. And the exception is you can cross dress for the purpose of entertainment, bonafide public entertainment. You can cross dress for stage play. But I think, in my own, in my own opinion, I think there is a loophole in what exactly amounts to cross dressing for a woman here in Nigeria. What exactly means cross dressing from the side of a woman? If we are to literally give the interpretation of cross-dressing from the cross-dressing bill that means all these tomboys in nigeria will go in for it all the tomboys will definitely go in for it when this bill is finally signed into law and guess what a number a high number of celebrities will definitely go in for this law celebrities like ten celebrities like dj lambo dj switch Kathy, Kathy the Dancer, Banty, Rio Mavis, celebrities like Rio Mavis, the former BB Niger, a housemate, celebrities like Wade MC, 
all of them definitely caught by this bill if it's being signed to law. These are the celebrities cross dressing. These are the female celebrities cross dressing in the literal interpretation of cross dressing in the cross dressing bill. What is your take on this new bill on cross dressing? Leave your opinion in the comment section below. I'll be waiting. In my own opinion, I think the law, this bill has some lacuna on what actually is progressing from the female side but if if it's not a lacuna from from the bill that means the bill is trying to tell us to take it the way it is like interpret the definition literally the way it is and if that is the case that means all the celebrities that i mentioned these female celebrities that i mentioned here are going in for this cross-dressing bill not just bob risky then really james brown not just them and that is this for today on cross-dressing law where i constructively constructive criticism constructively criticize this cross-dressing law on having some loopholes here and there but if they say it's not a loophole it's okay we'll sit down and watch out the outcome Thank you for watching. Share this video if you like it. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you have not subscribed. And if you're already a subscriber, thank you so much for subscribing. See you guys next time. Bye.